in the old consciousness, I'm just going to like give contrast. Yeah. Okay. So in the old consciousness, it's really defined by kind of some very low resonating dense distortion patterns and scarcity is one of them yes. like not like not enough of something right that's the and that's what feeds low self-worth non-deserving yeah. not enough not enough not enough and that's based on the illusion of separation the only reason we feel like we're not enough that things are scarce right. that we have to oppress in order to gain something take yes. something from someone else so we have something you know greed all that sort of stuff mm -hmm. all of that is because we there's this illusion of separation that we're not part of the one, right? That we're separate from. Mm -hmm. And in that separation, it's very painful. So that, that reinforces that sense that you have to seek outside yourself to be complete. Mm -hmm. That you're separate, you're not infinite indestructible consciousness, integral to everything. And you and I have talked about this before yeah. in terms of the veil of forgetting, right? Yes. So when, where does the illusion of separation come from? Just in case somebody is new and hasn't heard this before. Yes. So when you come into embodiment, you have to drop in into this vibrational level. So it's a, it's a drop usually in vibrational yeah. level into density. Yeah. Because don't forget, density is only 0.00001% of the all that is. Everything else is not dense. It's disembodied, right? It, it's, it's like ephemeral. Energy. Yeah, exactly. Energy. It's not solid. Yeah. Yes, it's energy or frequencies or whatever. Yeah. Okay. So in order to come into density or to form, you have to drop in vibrational level. And as you do that, you drop through the veil of forgetting. And in that veil of forgetting, it's a layer where you go through, where you forget, that's part of the agreement into coming into humanness, that you are part of the one infinite creator, that you are infinite indestructible consciousness. That is a huge forgetting. And for some people, that's really traumatic mm -hmm. because as you're dropping into density, right, you've made this choice to come into embodiment. You're wanting to experience the 0. 0.00001 or whatever it is, mm -hmm. right? Because it's exciting. You're like, whoa, it's like a rare thing. So I kind of want to experience that. And it sounds really cool. Mm -hmm. And then you drop through the veil of forgetting. You're like, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> this is horrible. No. <laughs> you're like, what? And then as you forget, for some people, that's really traumatic. Okay. And it can cause more distortion, mm -hmm. right? Because you're like, you forget that you're this infinite, indestructible consciousness, a part of the one. It's like a huge, massive forgetting, and that's what we're remembering now. So mm -hmm. the, and that's what causes all these distortions of scarcity, greed, all these things we just mentioned, right? Because if you're not part of the one, you're not part of that infiniteness. Mm -hmm. You're not part of, you know, that all that is. When you're not part of that, you feel like you're finite. Yeah. Right? That there isn't enough. That there is only this physicality. That there is only all this the lifetime. Distortions all the distortions. Come from that. Yeah. A lot of them. So wait a minute. So wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> so people who are born now or mm -hmm. soon, mm -hmm. while this new consciousness is here, mm -hmm. what, they don't have the veil of forgetting? They don't have distortion? No, they still have the veil of forgetting because they okay. wanted to come into humanness. Okay, but humanness, what, if you're human, you have... You've dropped through the veil of forgetting. Okay. 